Hello everybody, how we doing, how we doing? My name is Quantic Flux, and today we are checking out the demo for a game called Damon Sigil. Probably actually called Demon Sigil, but uh, when I see D-A-E, I say day. So Damon Sigil it is. <laughs> um, it is a turn-based creature collecting card battler uh, with roguelite upgrades. So without further ado, let's see what that means. We're gonna go in on normal. Hover over, hover over mouse cursor. Whoa, <laughs> it skipped it. it Might've been a loading screen, I'm not sure. Welcome to the demon sigil demo. Please note that this demo does not contain the momentum system is mostly meant to showcase the card battle system. Okay, let's quickly run through the basics and get you on your way. The time has come to prepare yourself for the Eldritch invasion that is threatening the world. Like every hunter trainee, you must prove your worth on the first hunt. You will soon be issued a special trial hunt to test your abilities in battle. You must defeat it before the hourglass runs out. Okay, so we've got eight hours, I guess. To do so, you'll need to roam the land in search of powerful... I'm going with daemons. Daemons to add to your deck. Moving between nodes costs one food. Entering a node costs one tick. Great, that's pretty much it for the other overworld. Now go ahead and get to select your hunt. Welcome to the hunt board. On the screen, you can see the demon, damn it. <laughs> hunts available in the demo. You will find hunts ranging from easy to hard. Defeat them all and earn the rank of pro hunter. Select the demon you wish to face for your trial. And I get to keep them? Uh, Let's kill a goblin. And by kill, I mean capture. Don't underestimate them just because they are goblins. They can deal a lot of damage before you even make your first move. Ah, they have difficulty levels. Okay, I think it probably makes the most sense to go for the easy one. Okay. And where is it? I don't know. This is the pre-battle screen where you can see the demons of this location can flee an encounter at any time. Careful, fleeing once engaged in battle, though, costs one life. You can bring up to five daemons to an encounter. Placing cards in your hand costs casting points. Okay. The higher your caster level, the more casting points you have available. You have unspent casting points. Go ahead and add Jackalope to your hand by dragging it from your deck at the bottom of the screen. Start the battle when you're ready. Okay. Jackalope. You're about to battle Dust Bunny. Press tab to look at our deck. Okay. Cool, cool, cool. I don't want to read all this, but it's cool. I like that it's here. All right, battle. Welcome to battle. Battle is divided into two phases, placement and action. You must place all your cards before initiating the action phase. To attack by selecting a card, then clicking on the desired target. Demons can only attack in the directions their arrow points. Okay, so this guy can only attack forwards. Proper card placement is essential for success in battle. When possible, try to match your arrows with the opponent's undefended sides to avoid a counterattack. Uh, okay. That should be easy with this guy, since he only attacks left and right. Some demons have special skills. Icons on the right are active skills and can only be used once per battle. Icons on the right. Okay, so we have one of those. Uh, to use a skill, select a card, click on the skill icon, then click on a valid target. Skills on the left of the card are passive and do not require an action to be used. They are triggered. Passive skills can be triggered multiple times during battle. Sometimes a daemon's only valid action is to pass. To pass, select a daemon, then press the pass icon. Remember, passing can also be used strategically. Nature and elements. Every daemon has at least one nature that grants it special abilities. Pay close attention to a daemon's elemental affinity and weakness. Exploiting these can be the key to victory. For more in-game information, hover your mouse cursor over the icons you'd like more information about. You can also consult the glossary at any time in the tab menu for more information on the nature, skills, and status conditions. Cool. Coin toss. The opponent has won the coin toss. They get to play first. Keep in mind that the coin toss can be affected by luck. Playing first means you get to act first during the action phase, but it also means you place the first card on the board. Playing second allows you to better take advantage of the card placement, but you're at the mercy of your opponent's first action. Okay. So, I'm going to play you here. Uh.
what uh what's the middle one adds a five percent bonus on chance rolls affects the probability of the ai to commit mistakes interesting charge deals one extra damage when attacking I think you only have one health so can't uh not telling me about the enemy unfortunately okay we'll blast you get wrecked victory 26 gold and one oh no beat it <laughs> At the end of battle you have the opportunity to seal one of the demons you've just defeated stealing a new daemon requires one empty sigil if you don't have any empty sigils you can co-op an old daemon for a new one okay I don't see any reason not to take you. Well, you just heard signals a passage of one tick. Press tab to access your deck menu. Casting points are limited to your caster level. You can increase your caster level by purchasing them here. All you need to know for now. Good luck. Okay. Sure. Cool. Two out of four. Got it. I think this is an elite. Which is scary. Uh, I don't know what you guys do. Hovering is not telling me. Critters have a 10% chance of finding food after surviving a battle. Elemental steal one extra damage when dealing elemental damage. Okay. Familiars evolve into a stronger version when the caster reaches level 10 and again at level 20. Cool. Um, I guess you're grass and water, probably, and you're, like, grass and wind. Sure. Okay. That's rough. Um, but Jackalope can take one attack. And you can't do anything to me. Uh, reach is here, middle. This indicates whether demon is melee, range, or flying. Arrows indicate the direction they can attack. Sure. Active skill. One time use ability. Using active skills requires an action. Okay. Uh, holding down a shift button. Interesting. Okay. Icons on the left of the skill card are passive. Yep, we know that. Conditions. These are cards' conditions. Conditions can have negative or positive effects. Attributes. Indicate the skill's level. The icons on the right are either the passive skill's trigger or the active skill's targets. Okay, and that I'm not super sure about. Nature. These icons represent the demon's natures. Natures grant additional, sometimes unique effects. Indicates now how common a card is. Rare cards are usually more powerful. That's the diamonds, I guess. Affinity indicates the elemental type of the demon. How's that different than nature's? Huh. Uh, power, yep, we know that. Weakness. Got it, okay. Got it. Okay, so you are weak to air. You're weak to water. Got it. Okay. I want to attack you. Get bodied. Nerd. I want to attack you. Easy dub. Uh, what is happening? Uh... That's a problem. Did not think this one through. Uh-oh. <laughs> oh, easy. Get wrecked. Right. Okay, 60 gold, that's a lot. And a food. 
Um, bat is in play. Invisible enemies remain visible. Be useful. Or a chance to lay an egg. Interesting. Cards cost to cast. I think I'm going to grab you, even though you're more expensive. Okay. Sure. Store. Just spent a bunch of money. <laughs> Is this? Uh, let's go this way and find out what that thing is. Goblin fighter, rat, and caterpillar. Okay. Or... Okay. Okay, so we want to attack with you. Want to attack with you. You have like uh your elemental weakness is grass, okay, so you should take two damage here. Nice. Get bodied, dude. Okay, what do we got here? Evolves into second form, damage dealt to demon rem uh remains. It evolves at the end of the round. Pretty cool. Deal extra damage to plants. 10% chance of finding food. Pack demons gain up to one attack buff and one defense buff conditions when played side by side in battle. That's interesting. Hmm. Um... Caterpillar is most interesting, to be honest. Cost two. I understand. We can have one more. Carrion worm. Okay. Okay, so you can only tack left and right. What, uh... Comes back to life. That seems cheaty. Okay... I don't think Jackalope is surviving this one, to be honest. You're going to put the Carrion Worm here. Okay, I don't think we're getting a Flawless this time. <laughs> That's what I expected. That is a huge bummer.
Hmm. I think we have to attack here, which means Dust Bunny's gonna die. Okay, this is going pretty poorly, I'd say. Especially given that these two come back. Hopefully this evolution here goes crazy. Okay, I have to play first. That's a nightmare. Oh, dude, you can't attack when you're evolved. Okay. Good. Right. Our bat is super dead. We're going to use the ability of this guy. I'm realizing I... Probably should have attacked first. <laughs> we are so done, dude. Okay. You're melee. You're flying. Okay. You can't do anything to me, nerd. Get blasted. Okay, I think we might have turned this around. Basically, as long as I do this, the archer can't shoot me. Get out of here. Wah, wah. Okay, that was not a flawless victory, which is a bummer. What do you do here? It's one power if he defeats or targets a defeated demon. If our demon is destroyed. Forever? Deals one earth damage. Enemy, enemy demon in play. Wow. I think we grab the skeleton archer. Okay. We're definitely not going to be able to play him anytime soon, which is rough. Okay, we go into the elite fight. Uh-oh, we're outnumbered. We could take you out and put you in. Okay. Hmm. Gives up one attack buff and defense buff. It's neighboring allies when defeated. It's rough. We toss out Bat. Hmm. is going poorly for us because the cricket is going to kill my caterpillar crap rip caterpillar
can't counterattack that. This is a nightmare. <laughs> Yeah, I think I'm screwed this time. Really, you're going to force me to go first? That's not cool, dude. Air guy's gonna come back after he dies. Not gonna matter though, because he can't do three damage if he only has two health. Did you just evolve? Extremely rude, my dude. <laughs> All right, we lost. Bummer. Um, I honestly don't know if we can beat that one. We flee for now. I'd prefer that you start. Dang rot. Fair enough. Hmm. That is a bummer to be sure. Excuse me? Why did you do two damage instead of one? Cheater. <laughs> okay, this card seems cracked. Also, why did our bat just die? This is the safest place for us to be. We're going to use our ability. Cheater. Hmm. I think this guy's got me. Yeah. Okay, we're losing basic fights. Not great. Let's try again. Cricket, sure. Get bodied.
this thing. Lucky. Sure. Get in there. Cave bat and B, you say. Cheater. <laughs> Okay, I call shenanigans on that. <laughs> when only two cards are left, they enter a duel. Both cards are granted a middle arrow if they did not already have one. Get bodied, nerd. Lying poison. You seem good. Okay. Caster reaches level ten. You've bested me, sir. not assuming I understand how poison works I don't <laughs> thought I might be able to cast it from wherever why are you alive ah because he could he didn't have a counterattack got it Um, I think this is the only way we can get him to move there to bait him. All right, it was messy, but we did it. We got here. Devour. You have devour as a passive. Whenever you defeat someone, you gain a power. Your melee. Orange target demon to life with one power. Hmm. Torch target demon power by one. Uh, let's try praying mantis, I guess. up toss you in your cost two Usaki seems good
Um. Sure. Probably should have attacked you first, I'm realizing. That was stupid. <laughs> and you can't do anything. Yeah, that was uh that was not good on my part, I'd say. You basically have to go here. Flying far, that's there. Should get one power though. You cheater, how dare you! <laughs> Okay, I think we lost, and I think it's because I'm dumb. <laughs> yeah, I'm not sure I'm understanding why you're not taking damage. This one I think we can actually win. Okay. I don't understand why you're not taking counterattack damage. Is that something special that you do or? Yeah, sneak, got it. Okay. Attack flying, you freaking nerd. But it's a tie, anyways. Do I win it in the event of a tie? I do. Hell yeah. Okay. You seem cracked. Yeah. Cost three, though. It's a lot. B, I think you suck. I can't afford you. Crap. Okay. Surely it must be better to have four than three. We have three food left. Because I haven't been foraging. 
Dude, how am I supposed to be five guys when I only have four? Um... I guess. I know what I expected. Hmm. Put down the praying mantis, the dodo is going to kill it. Should have had them go first for sure since I have less units. Um, if I put the praying mantis here, they have to kill it with the wisp. Boy, was I wrong. <laughs> um, Mistakes were made, that is to be sure. Bring back B. Okay. I think I'm screwed. Be clear. Especially since Horned Frog just ignores the next damage. about we already used our special ability You basically have to go in the middle, but that means Horned Frog is going to kill you. Okay, that was a mistake. Should have gone after Rat. We definitely lost this. <laughs> You guys still have negate damage, which is just going to kill me. Like, what am I supposed to do about this horned frog? <laughs> Best I can hope for is a tie. And that's just not going to happen. Yeah. So he just negates the damage, so it doesn't matter. Rip. All right. Well, this game's very hard. 
<laughs> it's fun though. It's interesting. I like what I saw there. Wish I'd gotten to the end at least once. Uh, but yeah, I suggest you check it out on your own. Uh, they have a demo freely available and uh, it was fun. Very interesting combat system. Um, it comes out sometime in 2024, not a very specific date, but uh, yeah, give it a shot. Tell me what you think. If you liked the video, uh, I would appreciate it if you left a like or a comment or both. Uh, anything to keep engagement up and get me noticed by the algorithm would be amazing, and I would appreciate it greatly. Um, my name is Quantic Flux. If you want to see more from me, I put out several series a day. Uh, what you just watched is called Check It Out, where I check out a new, usually indie, usually roguelike game every single day. And with all that being said, I want to thank you for your time. I appreciate that you spent it watching my video. And I hope you have a great rest of your day. Take care, everybody. Bye.